Hey, what's up guys? It's me, Cloud Gaming here, bringing you another Red Dead Online video. In today's video, I'm going to be giving you my ability card loadout, um, why I use my cards, and, um, basically why I think they are the best cards that, for me personally, maybe you guys want to change it, but why I personally think that they are the best cards, so I'm going to go ahead and get into it. So my uh, dead eye card that I'm using is the painted in black. Um, the reason that I don't use a moment to rec or a moment to recuperate, um, I don't really think that. I think that it would be a good dead eye card, but I don't think that with the um, I don't think that because it slowly regenerates. Um, it doesn't regenerate fast enough. I think it would've, if it would regenerate just a little bit faster, it would be good. But because it doesn't regenerate very fast at all, um, I would say that it's not good. At least for the base card, which I think I have base cards for most of these. Um, why I don't use Focus Fire? Um, I don't think that the fact that teammates deal a little bit more damage um, ha will... I, it personally doesn't help me because I usually play solo and then if I do play with somebody I play with one or two people um, and I only do that every once in a while so I don't really pay attention to uh, the extra damage dealt uh, but my card that I do use is I'm gonna go ahead and show you this um, so mine is painted in black uh, painted in black is basically the story mode um, it's the story mode version of Deadeye, so whenever you hover over someone, it puts an X, and you don't have to click RB, so if somebody's running and you hover over them with Deadeye, it'll just, and you go straight up, it'll just go tink, 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 and then you can shoot them, uh, everywhere that it automatically locks onto. Um, number two, uh, that I would put on is the Horseman. Um, deal a little bit more damage while on horseback. I use this because a lot of the time that you are playing, you are you are on horseback. So, for example, if you're doing bounty hunting, if you're doing collectors, and for some reason you're fighting an enemy, um, if you have to fight an enemy on Moonshiner, if you have to fight an enemy during Trader, all of these uh, horsemen is good for. I'm not sure if it works for wagons. But even if it doesn't, you can just call on your horse, um, which I will do sometimes, which helps me out with um, my, which helps me out doing damage and finishing the mission faster. For my second passive, I have Gunslinger's Choice. While dual wielding with ranged weapons, you deal a little bit more damage and are a little bit more accurate. I'm not sure exactly what range weapon, what it means by range weapons. I'm assuming it means um, revolver. I can look it up right now, but um, from what I know, it does mean revolvers, which means that me using revolvers a lot of times, um, it is actually good for me to use that. Dual wielding range weapons is if you equip the holster you have a secondary. Yeah, so the dual wielding range weapons is dual wielding um the pistols and the uh revolvers. So I am right. So um yes, dual wielding the pistols and, or revolvers means that you do a little bit more damage and you are a little bit more accurate. So for example, if you're aiming down your pistols, you're more likely to hit your target. Then if you didn't have this, you might have a little bit wider spread, so it might just go over them. Or you might do a little less damage, so you can waste more ammo or die faster. Um, so that's why I use this. And then for this one, I have Winning Streak. So Winning Streak is basically, and I just equipped this because I didn't have a third uh, ability card. And I needed to get one. Um, so winning streak is basically each consecutive shot made on the same target, you deal more damage. Um, and if you don't hit a target for 10 seconds, then you don't do that amount of damage. 
So, the reason that I think this is good is because, for example, again, if you're doing Moonshine, if you're doing Bounties, if you're doing Trader, if you're doing Collectors, um, and you're fighting somebody in Collectors for some reason, you can hit a target. So, let's say it takes five shots to kill a target, and you hit them three consecutive times, then that fourth one might kill them. Which is why I think it's good, especially if you level it up, which I haven't leveled any of these up because I don't have $350 to spend on each of them. Um, which I think I might need to start uh, grinding to get these, but um, I think that... I'll go back here. I think this, this is good just because um, that little bit of damage can make a big difference in saving you money for ammo and also... Um, killing faster and maybe saving you the trouble of having to go all the way back to where you were. So this is my ability card loadout. Um, if you guys want to see it, I can use all of them at once. And this is why I usually like to use them. I, the reason that I use the um, my third passive is because I or not my third passive, sorry, my my uh, gunslinger's choice is because I usually use dual wheel revolvers. Um, so, for example, if I do that, each shot does a little bit more damage, which helps me out um, quite a bit, especially when dual wielding uh, does a little bit more damage and is a little more accurate. And each shot that I hit does a little more damage, plus the dead eye, so I can lock onto them and shoot multiple times anyway. And then horseback. So, for example, if I'm dual wielding, hitting multiple shots on a horse, um, using dead eye, then it's extremely easy to kill someone. Um, which is basically my playstyle. I'm usually on a horse. I'm usually dual wielding. And I'm usually using Dead Eye if I have it full. Um, so that's why I chose mine. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, please do like it. If you really liked it, please do consider subscribing. But if you're kind of on the fence, please do feel free to check out a different video. I post daily uh, Red Dead and daily GTA videos. And also, or almost daily GTA videos. But I also post daily Modern Warfare videos. Um, I'm sorry for everyone who is used to watching my Modern Warfare videos that I haven't been posting recently. Um, for some reason, I have to I had to reinstall Modern Warfare because it wasn't working. Um, even after I put in the Season 4 update, I am going to be putting in uh, multiple videos today, hopefully. Um, some for Season 4, some for other stuff, uh, just playing. Um, but yeah, uh, if you guys didn't like it, please tell me why down in the description below, and goodbye.